Hello again, everybody. This is Rob Bobberty, and welcome to The Free Rider. Uh, this game contains intense environments, flashing images, loud noises, jump scares, dark theme, and violence. If you can't handle any of these elements, please... Blah, blah, blah. Uh, this is about a famous writer whose wife goes missing after their first year, one year anniversary. Uh, Deputy Steve, flashlight, shift, look around. Okay. Um, don't know what it's about beyond that. Oh, right click to look closer, I think. It's good to know. Oh! Okay. That was a nice uh, start there. I'm getting some bugginess on the screen. Is it just. Oh, it's on there. Okay, where, where is Mia? Maya? Mia? Maya? Okay. Is that me? That's not good. Oh. Okay. Alright. It's 3 a.m. Oh, it's right click to turn the zoom on and off. Okay. Hi there. You look like a friendly sort. Can I do anything? Yep, still 3 a.m. That was a weird thing there that just happened. I think the the rain showed up on me. Okay, I don't even know if E does anything. Oh, something weird's happening here. Oh, it's open. Ha! <laughs> Hello? What's in here? Anything? We got some pillows. We got a lot of a lot of uh, accessory stuff. That wall's a weird wall. All green. Looks weird there. Can I open this door? Why would I go to... I don't know. Did I hear something weird? Maybe because of that weird sound coming from down there? That's a good reason. <laughs> I wasn't supposed to hear that yet. Okay. Aww. So we, we had a daughter, I think, maybe? What is a calendar of some sort? Can't read it, though. Right, I guess we're going upstairs. Okay. Hello. That was Nicholas Cage for a minute. All right. Where are you, Mia? Maya? That's it. I don't know if it's Mia or Maya. I'll go in here first and go outside. Can I go through this door? There's weird sounds through all the clo all the doors I can't go through. That's kind of weird. Okay. I guess we're going out here. Nope. Don't hear anything through that one. <laughs> what? Did I just run into the door? What happened? What happened? Okay. All right. Well, I'm going to... Oh! I can't go out there. Is that glass? Oh. I thought... I thought it was open. Oh, it's all glass. It's a whole big glass thing. Okay, I thought it was... Alright, what about this one? Still locked? So, still something, some heavy breathing behind that door. Can I call? Oh, I thought that was... Okay, there's the basement door. That's... No doors in there. Okay, I tried. Wait. Wait a minute. There's no... Wait a minute. Wait, wait. Is there no door to the outside down here? Is this a basement, even though there's windows? Can I see anything out there? Nope. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. There, this isn't the basement. There's... Oh. Who was messing with my dishes? What? <laughs> was that that? Was that you? I don't know where that came from. Hey, can I check the basement now? I don't know. What is down there? Let's listen. Something being dragged and put down? I don't know. Maybe you never go down there and it's just almost an Easter eggy thing. I don't know. Okay, so things happen. Yeah, there's no... 
There's no door outside down here. That's weird. <laughs> okay. Maybe, the, is this outside? No, it doesn't look like it. Okay. Still locked. Here's the other heavy breathing room. Okay, what did I miss? Do I have to use the toilet to advance? Let's okay, I can't get through that one. Whee! Um, what did I miss? Can I hear? You can hear it. You can hear it here, too. Because I'm close to where it is. Turn the TV on? No. Walking back and forth. Oh, shoot. ah! Did I just? Oh, I was on the plant. I think. Okay, so I don't know where to go now. Wait, back in the bedroom, maybe? I hear you. I hear you, breather. I guess back to the bed. Actually, yeah, I didn't go back to the bedroom when I went everywhere else. Still 3 a.m. Presumably a.m. I'm invisible. Did I just see something? Oh, I saw that, I think. Okay. Okay. Not sure where I'm going here. Am I supposed to be finding something? Or is it time based? Oh! Oh! I meet him. I meet Mark at his. I'm not sorry. Book signing event. That's the best day of my life. To finally meet the best writer in the whole world and my biggest crush. He's so awesome. I love him so much. I even took a selfie with him. I'm thinking about framing it with the caption, Mia Summers with the best author in the world. I really wish he would notice me and I would have have, the, have to change it to the best husband in the world. Move to continue? Oh, okay. Okay. So she was a fan. I don't know. I think you need to, though, eventually. Okay, so she was... Where is that? What was that? That sounded like a chair. It definitely sounded like a chair being moved. Oh, there. It is a chair being moved. Okay. So someone's moving my stuff around here. Any in the bedroom now? Oh, what's this? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. He noticed me. He actually did. Okay, I need to calm down. A few days ago, I made an interview with my sister Megan about how much I love Mark's work, and I'm probably the biggest fan of all time, and I got aired out on a news network. Mark saw it and reached out to Megan so he can arrange another interview, but this time he'll be in it too, so he can meet me in person. Okay, where is it going to go horribly wrong? Man? What? Where was that? <laughs> I don't know where that was. Is that the basement? I don't probably, why would I go to the basement? Yep, why would I go to the basement? It sounded like a door door, not a... Seems like there should be a door going outside here. <laughs> I don't know where that came. I guess maybe it's upstairs. Probably the door without heavy breathing, maybe. Ooh, I almost walked. Oh, yep, there. Okay. <laughs> Looks like there's nothing there. Okay, this appears to be my study. Wow, it is really coming down down there, out there. Right, like we're really. Oh my gosh, but hopefully she didn't go outside. She might have drowned. Oh, another one. He... I'm crying. I still... What? Is someone just tapping on the window? I need to breathe slowly. That's so unbelievable. A few minutes ago, Mark meets my dad to ask if I want to if I want to marry him. <laughs> yes, that's real. I myself wouldn't believe it if, it's, if I didn't eavesdrop. Eavesdrop. They're still talking downstairs. I really hope it's not a dream. I, I can't type anymore. My hands are shaking so much. Okay, so, so, hi, monkey. How you doing, monkey? What you doing? What you doing, monkey? Okay, the monkey has nothing to nothing to say or add. Okay, so we. Okay, yeah, I didn't mean to do that. I was just looking around. Okay, so someone was tapping, tap, tap, tapping on. What the hell was that? Uh. 
My flashlight. Uh, my flashlight is broken. Still broken. Oh, no, it's not. Okay, I don't know what that was. It was weird. Okay. Alright. What about this door? Let's check this door. Locked. Still heavy breathing. Yep. Oh. Hi. Wait, how did my TV work? I don't have any power. <laughs> the chairs are... Did that one just move? I think it did. What? What? Where? What? <laughs> what happened to the chair? That's, I see it. I see the new one. Okay. Hang on. I'm just checking to see if there's anything else. Best two weeks of my life. Not only am I spending my honeymoon in the best resort in the world, but I'm also spending them with my most beautiful, handsome, awesome man, Arthur, Arthur husband in the world. Can't say the same for him. He doesn't look happy since he's two weeks away from his job and from finishing his new book. I know Dad kind of forced him to stay in our resort. Yes, Dad owns a VIP resort, but it's Dad's honeymoon gift, so why not? Okay. Alright, so am I not happy? Why is she the one who seems to be missing then? Something looked weird there. Okay. Going back upstairs. Or maybe I should go to the kitchen first. Let's let's not go in the basement one more time. Yep. Why would I go in the basement? I don't know, you know. So yeah, none of those things that well they're wait. Oh, that's just reflections. None of these notes, all these notes are from when they first got married, so I don't know if I'll find if I don't know if the pictures on the fridge are just decoration, basically. You know, that maybe it doesn't really mean that they have a kid. Yep, I hear you, Brady. Okay. Is something going to be out here? I don't know. Go back in here, I guess. Hello? Hey, you turned. What are you doing now, monkey? Monkey, 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 monkey. Okay. Uh, ooh, what's that? That is a creepy hallway. Hey, in the moon. Did I miss another note? I bet I missed another note. That's usually... <laughs> so far, that's what that usually means. If nothing's progressing, it's not that I... Some of these games... I hear you. Some of these games, it's like you... Like this, like you walk back and forth, and it's like... Sometimes it just takes forever to trigger the next event, but this I keep missing the note. I think is usually what's happening. What's that? Oh, that's part of that. Are do the old notes disappear? Yeah, they do. Okay. You know why? Stop asking why I'd go to the basement. It's obvious. <laughs> All the noise is coming from it. What's that book? That looks old. Oh, there we go. I didn't see this one. Oh, wait, no, I saw this one. So what am I missing now? Oh, I think there's two at a time a lot. It's still 3 a.m. Okay. Oh, there we go. Wait. What? Um. What? That's not a note. That's a bathtub filling up. Hello? Oh, that's not a good thing. Behind you? Hi! <laughs> it's the toilet paper man! He's come to get me! Okay, so the note isn't really there. Okay. No, don't, don't, don't get me to- Can I pick these up? Can I move them? Or are they- Yeah, they can move them. The toilet paper man's coming to get me. So, is this the X? Is that what's going on? <laughs> right. Hey! Is that the monkey? <gasps> monkey! You came to see me. Okay. So, should be something up there then, I guess. Oh, hi! Hi, friend! I see you. You're not moving. Are you going to disappear when I get Well. I, I got to stop buying discount. What? 
<laughs> that was like, uh, it was just on the one side, so it was like something blew in my ear. Uh, hey, you took my flashlight? Stuck? Free? Stuck? What? The heck? Wait, what? Why? Wait, wait, why am I... Wait, this isn't my office? Oh, this is the other room. Oh, I, I went... That's the one he opened. Okay. His new book really weighing him down. He's recently angry all the time because of the publishing deadlines. Yesterday morning he went full rage at me because I accidentally broke a plate. In the afternoon he almost hit me because I fell asleep on the couch while watching the TV. He said the static noise scared him. He even throws a chair at me for no reason. I'm sure he's doing that out of stress. So I'm an asshole is the problem here. So she did, she does sewing. She does make dresses. Oh, they're pretty. Uh, okay. And paints. And plays with piano. And I write and yell at her. Okay. We've established everything that happens here, I think. And I still don't know if there's a kid. I keep thinking this is open, but it's never open. Whoa, whoa, hey, no one need to throw paintings. <laughs> uh, oh, there's another note. Oh, we're not doing notes anymore. <laughs> or are we, yeah, I guess we did the last one. What was that? I did, I just barely saw it. Where'd you go? Ah! That's what, oh, I guess I'm not going up there now. Okay, how about the bedroom? Is that gonna shut on me? Nope. Oh, I'm shut in. Hi, nobody home. <laughs> Get shit done. Nice. Hi. If I'm going. Okay, we move the bathroom. Hey, my phone. Okay. Wait, was that my phone? No. Flashlight. Oh. Hey, sweetness. Guess what? It's almost time. Why? Why? Yeah. I Back away from the window a little. You've been acting really weird. <laughs> okay. Should I keep looking at the window? Oh. Flashlight. A note. Okay. Something definitely bad is happening here. Mark kept saying that his house was small and old. To be honest, it wasn't that small or old, so I got the best gift for him, a new house. I talked to Dad yesterday about how stressed Mark is and how much it will help him if he gets a better house. So he bought a new house from his real estate. He even insisted that it will be a gift for him so he can keep writing a new answer. I will always support him no matter what happens. How about, how about, how about demons? Will you support him through demons? Because that might be what's going on here. Hi! You're kind of tall. <laughs> Is that the end? Did I just die from something? Or is there more? But we're still loaded. We're loading, so. I mean, I don't, something's still happening. Oh, am I in the basement now? Hello? What the heck? Oh, that's not good. Or is that me? <laughs> Hi! Okay, so now I'm trapped. Okay, so my ears are ringing. Yeah, I noticed that too. <laughs> it's very high pitched. Okay, so you left me the flashlight. Hi, monkey. I'll look at you in a minute. Oh, I don't know what's up there, but I imagine I need to look at this note first. Mark and I are finally back home from the hospital after the car crash where he broke his leg. He drove us home really drunk after the party celebrating his new book, The Free Writer. He kept talking about how this book 
will clear all his debts. When I asked him why, he hides that. He got angry and accidentally crashed. Or, seems like that'd be kind of obvious, really. He thinks it's going to make him a lot of money. Um, one, one year anniversary is tomorrow, and he's planning a surprise, as he said. But I think my surprise will be better when he knows that I'm pregnant with his child. Uh, okay. I can't. My leg hurts like hell. Can't. Oh, can't do the stairs? I want to know what's up. Um. Why did... You can, though. Am I not supposed to be going up? Are you able to go up here? You don't want to remember. Uh-oh. Did I... Was I... Was I bad? Why did that just... Oh, there was a... I can't... <laughs> Apparently you can. You just don't want to. Oh. Did she lose the baby? Is it going to be one of those? That's a baby bottle. Gun. No, that's a pill, pill bottle. Hey. Is this one of those where I went crazy? I thought that I thought that closed behind me. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I can't run. I was hitting. I didn't realize I was hitting escape or hitting shift. Okay. Okay, monkey. What's? Oh, I thought that was a different one. Different thing. Hello. Of course, it's locked. Oh. Hi, monkey. How are you? Um. Okay. What can I? Oh, I can get around here. I thought I was trapped. I thought I was trapped by the monkey. Oh, I'm zoomed in still. Okay. Why am I doing arrow keys? Okay. Garbage bags. This is. This isn't over. If you say so. More monkeys. Hey! Oh, I tried to run again because I'm smart. Okay. Books and, books and garbage and over. What's going on? Hey! Hey now. Okay, the one sound was the bottle going, but what was the other sound? Oh, hi. You're going to open the door for me. How nice. I'm getting like a, a lot of familiarity of other games like this where you're, it starts off kind of normal and it just kind of falls apart and it turns out it's all happening. Um, oh, that's weird. <laughs> that's creepy. I think I've said this before, but I don't think I'm recording stereo, but you can definitely tell that the... The sound is coming from the, from that painting. Okay, am I supposed to go through the painting? Oh, hi! Hi. What you doing over there? Hello. Hi. What you do? Oh, you're big. You're pretty tall. What the heck? Was that? Was that what I think it is? I keep hitting shift, thinking I can run. Oh, well, that doesn't happen often. Okay. It was always wrong. What? You're the reason for this. For what? Okay. So I'm gonna go back to the basement. Am I trip? Am I trapped in the basement again? I am. Okay. What? Okay. Am I going to reset the power? I heard a weird sound over to the right. I don't know what it was. Oh. Thanks for calling an event. Let's uh, turn the power back on, maybe. Is that a thing? Am I, like, really short? <laughs> Can open it with a hammer. Okay. I have a hammer in the locker. Is this the locker? No, that's the door. Just... Oh, hi. Hi there. We got some mannequin stuff going on here. Where's the locker over 
here. That's locked up. And that's locked. Well, how am I supposed to get the hammer then? I can open it with the crowbar. Okay, where's the crowbar? I thought I was going to tell me where the crowbar is. Okay. Crowbar, crowbar, crowbar. Where for out that part thou? Just run, it's fine. You can do it. I don't see it, I'm probably missing it. It's probably right in front of me. Yep. Still don't see a crowbar. Whee! Climb up the door. Where the heck's the crowbar? no actual action button in this, so all I have to do is run into it, pretty much. So I must have just missed it somewhere. Where the heck is it? Okay. Couldn't I use the crowbar on this, on the door? If I can find the crowbar. Doesn't even say anything now. Wait a minute. There's a pickaxe in there and a gun. What the heck? <sighs> digging a ground, digging a hole in the ground. That's not good. Um. Hmm. I don't know where I'm going here. It's on the floor there. Cola. It is a can of cola. Okay. Maybe. Do I need to move this thing out of my way? Excuse me. It's somehow immovable. Maybe I shouldn't have taken so much acid before I went to sleep. Maybe that's the problem. Okay, where's the crowbar? Just run. You can do it. It's all a dream or anything anyway. Okay. Does it stay the same thing? Doesn't say anything. I don't understand. Must be missing it somewhere. up there can't reach <laughs> maybe the shovel <laughs> where's the shovel I didn't see a shovel did I is the shovel through the oh wait that shovel wasn't there there I got a shovel maybe it was there okay so we use the shovel to reach the crowbar to open the locker there you go. Nice. This little animation for it, instead of it being poof, we have it. I got a crowbar. Am I in Half-Life? Is this Half-Life 3? Oh, there we go. Okay. There we go. No, I don't... Oh, well, hammer's good, too. I was going to say, I don't want to lose a crowbar, but a hammer's, a big hammer's pretty good, too. Okay, let's bash the door down and see what horrible secrets lie behind it. Thank you, ghostly, ghost sleeper. Ghost <laughs> All right, what horrible things. <laughs> Did you? <laughs> well, upon hearing a gunshot, the police arrived at the house where the shot is heard and witness a horrible crime scene with two bodies found in the basement. They belong to the fair, very famous writer Mark Wenzel and his wife, Mia Summers, who's the daughter of our town mayor. After the investigation, the police confirmed that this is not a housebreaking situation, but rather a homicide where the husband shoots the wife, burned and buried her in the basement. After what looks like regretting the decision, he shoots himself. They also found a will note and that the wife was drugged and pregnant before the incident. We can speculate a few things. The husband had financial problems. He marries a rich fan, drugging and forcing her to give him all her money with a will note after she trusts him, then killing her. Oh, Jesus. Did I just forget all this? I woke up and couldn't find her. So I must have just woke up and forgot. While the husband was trying to erase the evidence, he walked upon his wife diary, his wife's diary tablet to find out that not only he killed his wife, but also his unborn child. He tried to dig her up, but it was already too late, so he shot himself. But God has another plan because the bullet didn't kill him. It sends him into a coma, making him stuck between worlds and possibly in his own purgatory. 
We all hope he gets well soon so he can face the true punishment in court. This is Megan Summers from MCT News. Good night. Okay, talking about God having the plan, and it's kind of weird in the news thing. But, uh, that, so, he he killed her, and he shot her, shot her and killed her. So none of that was what actually happened. That was him being, going crazy in his, in, in his coma. So he shot her and made her, either made a will or made her make a will or whatever so that she would, he would get all her money. And then he found out she was pregnant after he buried her. Oh yeah, he buried her and then he found out from her diaries that she was pregnant. So then he tried to dig her up and thought he was going to save her or something, but it was too late. So he shot himself and now he's stuck in hell. I'd say it's more of a hell than purgatory if he's reliving that horrible thing. Uh, but that was, that was interesting and kind of sad. I came by, I don't know how to pronounce that. Uh, that was pretty good. I like that. Um, lots of creepy, creepy spots. Nice, um, nice environment and atmosphere in general. And, and the jump scares were done really well. A lot of creepy little things that, like, I don't even know if they were necessarily things you might not even find like when you walk up to the doors and you hear the weird sounds behind it and that was just kind of him hearing himself kind of or hearing what he did and this got loud so i don't know if you can really hear me that well uh but anyway this has been rob Boberty with the free writer and this i found this on itchu if you want to play it it is pay what you want and or free Thanks to you for playing the game. Uh, anyway, thank you for watching. As always, likes, subscribes, and shares are always appreciated. And I hope.